So we've just finished qualifying here at Brands Hatch. Uh, overall very happy with P11. We're, the good bit is we're only two tenths off the uh, factory team, so spending like four times as much as we are. So to be that close to them is mega. However, a bit disappointed because I know that lap time's in the car and we didn't quite get it. But we're looking to go forward tomorrow and can't wait to get racing. So we've just finished race one here. Good race, got a good start, good first lap, gaps, some gaps opened up and uh, but good old Sherman had good race pace all the way through as we predicted. So we ended up fifth and uh, I think another lap or two I could have had a go at the Hondas. But uh, we'll see what we can do in the next one. So we've just, uh, well, sort of done race two. Um, unfortunately, we broke a uh, prop shaft off the line. So uh, to be honest, I'm absolutely heartbroken. Um, it means we've got to start from the back in race three as well. Um, easy to say it now, but I, I, I do think we'd have been in with a shout, the podium and maybe even a win, but it uh, wasn't meant to be. So we've got a lot of work to do in the third one and we'll be fighting hard to get back up there. So we've just finished race three here at Brands Hatch. Uh, didn't do too badly. I got from uh, 28th on the grid to 11 uh, on a on a on a field like on a grid like that with uh, like I said earlier, world class grid. I'm really proud of that. Got some points on the board. Not quite the day we'd hoped for if we hadn't had that prop in race two. Prop break in race two. I think uh, a very very different day, but. Uh, at least we're showing the pace of Sherman and uh, we're looking forward to getting to Donington and putting it all together there.